Hello, my name is Swiss Bianco. In this video I will talk about the MSA ESP2 voice amplifier. Uh, that item comes in a box. Then as we take the item out below we have the paperwork. So we put that aside. There is the paperwork. Uh, how to install. It's a simple uh, solution with two clampers. I'm gonna show that in a minute. Uh, this is mainly for the M40 mask and similar ones. So that is the item. We have on top the part to turn it on and off as usual. On the bottom we have the flap for the batteries and that is uh, basically the main advantage they did use in this version two pieces triple A batteries instead of the older version that I did already made a video about it that uses the 9 volt uh, block battery which is that version here and then we have on the side those two big clampers that go over the gas mask. I'm gonna show that. And uh, the inside uh, looks a bit different too. Uh, we have on the new version that button here that is basically a safety as that is uh, in this position. It's not gonna work. You need to press that in uh, if you wanna turn it on without the uh, it's been mounted on the mask, so it has a automatic safety there. Now the size is quite a bit smaller, as we see, compared to the old version. Again, I made a video about this version uh, too. Uh, the sound is about the same. Uh, we did not uh, get much differences at all. Uh, you just have a less bulky item you have more common batteries and it's easier to put it on and off this the old one you had that threaded part that screws on uh, the new one has those two clampers and as we look at the mask we have the top metal ring and basically the item goes over that metal ring. It's a bit less easy to mount I would say than the regular one. Yeah, now it did click. Uh, you did hear the, the click. Uh, uh, basically you set it up. It's relative straight uh, that the button is on top and that boat both the levers click over that rim from the gas mask. And then the middle part, that safety there, that automatic safety got depressed. Now as you would turn it on, it would work. Now the question is, even as that is lighter and the uh, and, uh, more compact, in appearance. Uh, is it worth it? Uh, is it working well with those clampers? Uh, I'm a bit skeptical. I did not test it out uh, yet too much in the field. Uh, I wonder if somebody uh, has more experience uh, and say can tell if that gonna work like that or not. Uh, I wonder a bit, uh, even if you press only one side, of course the item comes off. So if you are uh, in the 
outside in the bushes and all that, that may uh, fall off in case the other one uh, that got screwed on will uh, still stay on. So I'm a bit skeptical for now because uh, it's a simple press and then it comes off just like that. So I really wonder Yeah, I, I really wonder how, how well that's going to work. So, uh, yeah, that much about the MSA voice amplifier. Uh, sure, an uh, interesting design. I'm just a bit skeptical with those, uh, with that clamper on it. So for now, I'm going to still use the old version that directly screws on.